Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Nobunaga's Ambition, Sphere of Influence. I'm the Mysterious JG. <laughs> Here's some detail that you want to know. I'm now covered in moisturizing creams. Fucking Vectivix. Penetumumumab, or whatever it's actually called. Look it up if you feel like reading horror stories of uh, dry skin. But not me, boy. I'm covered in moisturizer and ready to conquer some Japan. And for some reason, I'm acting like I'm drunk. All right. So we were in the middle of a domestic turn. I got the most basic, basic essentials down, which is making sure that we have some officers who are on their way to Makishima, uh, Makishima and uh, Nijo Palace. Makishima Castle, Nijo Palace. Uh, we need to get officers there, and we need to, in the case of Nijo Palace, get the walls rebuilt. There are other castles uh, where the walls got knocked down. Um, you know, some kind of... To marry and to Larry. What is the? Who are the aliens from the? Shaka and the Waltz fell. That's what I'm trying to reference for some stupid reason. Okay, we need to do a few things. We need to restore. This cannot be executed at this time. There don't appear to be any bases we can repair. Are none of the officers present? Why can't I repair the hit points here? Maybe they're already repairing? That one just seems, it seems odd to me that I can't do that right now. So Tsujikasaki. Special fare. Increases. I mean, God, at this point, we could just go conscripts, conscripts, conscripts. Smart thing would probably be to have uh, crops here doing a cargoman. Which would improve conscripts here, here, and here. I don't remember what special fare improves, but I'm thinking it's probably crafts because, I don't know. Special fare not, might not increase anything, actually, in the adjacent bases. But if I could do conscripts here. Yeah, what I should do is probably conscripts here, and the next time it expands, conscripts here, and if it expands again before it's over, agriculture here and try to get a cargoman. But this place is an E for conscripts, and this only has an F, so let's do conscripts here. Shingen will take care of this personally. Because he's got time <laughs> on his hands. Now that he's the Shogun, he can just go around personally building facilities. Uh, he's not, I guess we're not the Shogun. Are we the Shogun? They didn't say we were the Shogun. Actually, a thing to check on, because I'm curious about it, is whether... Whether we can now, uh, actually still get Imperial titles, because we hold the capital. This would be a great place to build a temple. And I think, oh, no. Over here, we got two different places. You know, I like the Buki Girder. I really do. And, uh, yeah, this is... This, no, man, we ain't about building no Christian churches here. We're conservative, but we're Japanese conservative, so... You know, that's not our whole deal. Before we delve into planning, let's strengthen our connection with the Coalition Focus Policy. Let us enact a policy. So, Coalition Focus Policy... Oh, by the way, we can do improved militia, so... Uh, we don't need to be building uh, more... Just getting rid of that one cal uh, church may have been enough. But, boom, we can do this. This will drop our labor significantly. It'll also cost us money. This is an expensive policy. Uh, and then... Coalition focus. Trust from clans coalition decreases every month. Trust from clans outside of coalition decreases every month. Uh, we got barely anyone in the coalition right now. Know. What would you like? I would like a deep butt. But I don't have a lot of money right now. 
Well, we sent a uh, treasure this way to get them powered up in the coalition quickly. Honestly, if we they already have interest, so I don't think it would be useful to give them a treasure. Let's see what it says, because I, I have a treasure I could offer, which is that sword, which I don't want to give away. This item is pretty nice. I'm sure it'll have a decent effect. Well, it would still do something. Maybe we should buy a teapot, give it to him to get the... Tra uh, the well, hold on, though. It would, it would, yeah, it would take him up to friendly, which means we get... Eh, let's leave it. Forget it. I don't think it's worth the effort. We, uh... What would you like? We're kind of short on money, though. And we've got some new expensive policies we've just enacted. So I think we need to sell some food. What would you like? Thank you very much. You are so stupid. We just had everyone uh, doing the whole overseer bit. So we can have... Pretty high end officers doing that. Now we can look and see. All right, road work because we got new palaces and castles and stuff. It looks like uh, oh, can't. It looks like they've been doing a decent job on their own. Uh, the Miyoshi had been building up roads around here, but the roads that have not been built up, yeah, we got enemy units. Just to get the the labor used up, we'll go ahead and have two different people doing those two different bits of road work. We probably do need this. Uh, these roads need to be nice, even though they don't directly impact uh, a city, because they affect our uh, path into enemy territories. So we'll throw a few bucks at this. And then be done there for a bit. Although, hold on. I should look and see. I do want to build kind of a corridor through here. Yeah, there's quite a few roads here that should be better if I really want good transport back and forth. That's a lot of cash. Leave that alone for right now. I've been working on this play. Like the recent places, I finally started working on getting you built up. And it was with the idea of getting a residence. And then probably a sally port. Because we can't get a gate. We can't get a gate that will actually do anything as far as. Uh, growth goes. We're working on the Tenchu and the Earth Wall here. And we need that last spot to get uh, residence. So we can't do anything more here. We need to let these uh, upgrades finish. Just keep checking to see if uh, cool facilities have become available. And cool facility is available here, and that's the residence. Okay, I don't. I've got residence, large gate, earth wall, sally port. I don't care about any of the facilities that are available. So here, we do stone wall, which would just give us more hit points. Let's go for a Barbican, which will increase attack power of horses at this base. Sell even what more food. Like? Again, Thank this is how our much. economy works. I, I have to be somewhat careful, but I don't have to be as careful as I was. Like, I'm not at real risk of getting some of the early game problems of running out of food. It's more about... Just don't get crazy with it. But I have to be willing to sell food because our entire economy is geared towards cranking out food rather than gold. 
and by our entire economy, I mean all of the uh, like uh, policies that are available to us as a conservative clan. They are all about cranking out food. Yeah, I think I had sorted this out. Need to come back here after all these upgrades are done. 15, uh, 15 labor unspent is fine. Let's uh, check and see if there's any tribes we really need to be working on. And I think we're fine over here. 84% is good enough here. Everybody here got orders? Yeah, everybody's doing something. Including Hanzo doing battle with Guardian Angel Satsuna. Sun at Suna, rather. You guys just took that castle, but I did give you new orders. So that's right, you're gonna go on and start some shit with the Tsutsui, so let's do that. Should be hearing from the Hojo pretty soon, didn't we send uh, envoys over to them? Let us help. Okay, so you guys, apparently, you're in awe of us, but you've got a truce with them. Vassal to the... Oh, never mind. You guys are an independent clan, but you've decided... Oh, you're a... You are a vassal to these guys, which is why you can march right through their territory. But you have a truce with the Miyoshi, and that's going to cause you to come try to break up our siege? The fuck? Alright, well these guys here's here's a couple cities that we can take as I try to bat our, our count. We're gonna we're gonna wipe out the Akamatsu and their vassals, the Besho, just because uh, I don't like them. They pissed me off. Alright. They they are about to try to break up the siege. Oh, but they're not going to make it in time. Marioka Castle says so surrender. It seems like this battle is ours. Picked up the rear guard trick. Have you got a bunch of uh, prisoners now? Seven prisoners. None of them will join us because they're all from... They're all going to be from Miyoshi clan who haven't surrendered. So we might get one or two, but we won't get a massive influx of new officers. Uh, we'll let this one take place. Oh, Sakonshima's in the wall. That's kind of interesting to me, but... This is uh, no created officers here, so we might just, in the interest of moving the LP along, maybe we'll let that battle play out off, off screen. Seems Hojo Clan has given us their answer. Very well, we'll join the Protocata Coalition and help in the fight to slay the Date Clan. So yeah, you are attacking us. We did not attack you. You are attacking us. So... Now that you're part of the clan... I don't know what they can do here. Uh, if you don't want... Yeah, I want uh, for now, okay, I think the uh, Kitapatake are kind of... They're just there. They're not going to do anything else for the rest of the Let's Play. Uh, the Hojo, on the other hand... We got guys marching around. I don't really know what they're up to. Let's check something here. So these guys are in awe of us, and they are not part of the Coalition. These guys are a vassal to the Usugi and are not part of the Coalition. All these other clans down here are part of the enemy Coalition. So, green and the blue logo here are kind of indifferent. They've only got one castle anyway. These guys, I believe, are part of the coalition. 
But they're hostile, but not part of the coalition. All right, here's what I say. Let's let's ask our allies, the Hojo, to take this clan off the map permanently. Oh, no, I have to select the Hojo first. Then I can select to attack Guillaume. And I think it's time... for us to take these guys out and just have a little base. You know what? No, 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 no. I should uh, change my mind. Because as far away as it is, there is a path where the Ashina might try to attack if we just empty Numata Castle. So let's have... Let's just get some units down there into the fray. Let's head out. Because this is what's ha always happened off screen. I started having fights. Like the Hojo started having to fight the Satake uh, because the Satake and them are now in opposite coalitions. And before that, nothing was really happening before that. And you guys are part of the uh, coalition to destroy uh, Takata Mania. So let's attack you. A decent officer up here first, really, but I don't have very great troop counts up here. I still think it's worth it. Like, let's get Oyama Temple, which is the starting point for this whole crazy business. Let us show them how we do battle. I'll have them march through, and uh, when they actually get to close to Yama Temple, we'll have uh, Takaoka and uh, Fukumitsu Castles commit to, and we'll all march together on Oyama Temple. See if we can at least we might end up like having a battle of attrition and not knocking out a bunch of their troops and not actually getting to uh well oh, the asakura are down here and I, I didn't have like i wasn't paying any attention at all all right it's time for vulture bronco it's time for vulture clan to get together and deal with this issue we're out of horses too shit I guess I'll just let them sit there and see what they think they're doing, because they don't have enough troops to take any castles. All right, all right, all right. Let's get back to it. I do need to start concentrating on getting more horses. I was going to let the AI just take care of this on their own, but... uh Oh, they're retreating. Never mind. That may mean... Because they were about to get hostile with us, and... Uh, like, they were coming down there to save that castle, which would have made them our enemy. And then at the last minute, it didn't happen. So we didn't actually ever engage with them. So I think we can just... Uh... This is where we move to take out Ishiyama Temple. And if I can do it without actually having to harm the castle, that's more than Nobunaga was able to do. He had to, like, burn them out. All right. Well, like, avoiding that fight, I'm, I'm pleased with that. Because that would have... I was going to take the... I, well, you know what? I guess I didn't care, but I don't have to deal with them now. They, I was going to be sort of forced to aggressively deal with them quickly because of that. Now, this would be a great time for these guys to suddenly get froggy and take Nijo Palace, but I don't think they're dumb enough to try. Agwan Morand. Uh... All right. He's a created officer. Let's, let's showcase his battle. Right. What well, says we got five one six eight, but he's only got forty five. So there must be yeah. There's tribals somewhere who are just going to take damage needlessly fighting towers. 
This is not a setup that is useful yes, to get them involved. Engage. So we got nullifies obstructions. Slightly raised attack, raises melee attack. Let's go for heavy crush. That'll allow us to just get through uh, fences and shit. He's going for interfere, which lowers our speed as we try to charge in. Lower my speed. I'm going to kind of counteract. Now I'm charging right into a musket attack. Great. Let's go. So this fight's not going as well as it should, but we're going to win it. Aglan Moran has this history, and it's it's not his fault. It's like it's it's the way I use his units, and then just what happens. Like he keeps taking heavy losses in in battles that he wins. That was what was happening all throughout the last RTK one. We defeated a troop right in front of their castle. Why does all knock down the walls? Shaka when the walls fell. So you guys are gonna surround that castle. If that truce ends suddenly, we'll be right in the middle of combat with them out of nowhere. Lim Limoriyama Castle says they'll surrender. Enemy and enemy officers have been apprehended. Leave it to me. So we'll have Tori Hanzo come swing around to the north to help with Tsutsui Castle. Uh, and we'll have Misako, because she has such a massive army. We'll have her get involved with uh, Nobunaga. I might just pull him out before he fights anybody, because we need a huge troop count to take Hishiyama Temple. Alright. Uh, if I manually control this fight, it will probably go better. But honestly... It'll be fine. I'll come out of this with barely enough troops to take the castle, but I'll also have Hanzo coming. And it looks like th this this fight. Well, yeah, I'll tell you what. This is the you know we'll we'll, we'll do this fight on screen because this is the big stand that Tsutsui are going to make. They're not going to have. And we might have more battles with them after this, but they they don't have enough troops to to fight after this. This is the battle where their main army is doing what it can to defeat us. Yes. This is a really bad starting position for me in this fight. So they got us in a river. So I'm in no great rush to engage. Yeah, because I want my guys to get in position. But uh, Mazuki Sanada fighting Sakonshima would, would have been really interesting. Didn't actually happen in real history. But they're two of the great strategists of the age. He's going win or die. Lowers defense, but greatly raise attack. Let's see if we can get him to attack himself now that his attack has been increased. We're not doing very well in this fight, though. Ah, there we go. That turned it around. We just got... We either got... We wiped out a tower that was interfering, I think. So he is charging... All right, let's just uh, let's just raise our melee attack for this uh, showdown because they're charging right into us. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a bloody mess. Attack. Oh, we're still trying to do range. That's why we're backing up. Leave it to me. 
But they just charged in hyper aggressively and got themselves wiped out there. Yes. So we need to get we've we've cleared Naramasa a path to cross the river. At this point we want to keep uh Ukon Takayama occupied with the En yeah, Enryakuji uh, tribe unit if we can, which it looks like he's gonna go for that. That'll give Naramasa time to cross the river, and we can avoid uh, Mazuyuki taking any more losses. They are going for musket tactics. So let's work extra hard to not get in range. And they are taking, we're taking some damage here, but. We're on top. The tribal unit's gonna get wiped, but uh, we're you know handily winning the fight with minimal losses. And now Masayuki's closing in more than I meant for him to. Let's have Naramasa charge and end this. Might even be able to save the uh, tribals. Retreat. And thank goodness we've got, uh, so that was kind of an interesting fight with the river and all that. But thank goodness we've got Hanzo coming to back them up because it might be Sakon. We lost enough troops there that it was, in fact, uh, it will be difficult to take uh, to Castle. Junko himself is ready to march. But we got Hanzo coming to support, so... Actually, I think what we should do is, uh, come back and resupply and then hit Tsutsui Castle. Meanwhile, this may be the le oh, wow. Let's see if we can get some, uh, other units to come in here and, and be part of the, the numbers. Yeah, there we go. This might be uh, the last battle before I finally, oh. after she took Nijo Palace, this might be when Natsu Natsuko Sasaki might actually, at this point, finally pull back. So we got Ryo Ryotoshi, who's seen almost no combat in all this, is finally getting a chance to, to get involved, because he's just... He's kind of peren perennial, perennially behind the lines. Very well. Acknowledged. I don't think there's any point to you getting involved. Yes, my name. He's got no troop counts at all. He's just going to take damage and he's just going to get himself wiped out. He's not going to affect anything. Alright, he's got greatly used raised own attack, lower speed, raised defense, all fire enemy strengthening. Let's uh let's wait till they use something and then we'll nullify whatever their strengthening is. Well it's even more momentary than you thought it would be. You all don't stand a chance. I thought I just nullified their strengthening. That seems like a BS to me. Oh, 
Well, maybe because they went for it again. You all don't stand Stop doing that. Yeah, we're taking a lot of damage. Yeah, Rio Riotochi's taking a lot of damage. Finally. I don't know if it's even working. Uh... Go with caution because we're not we're not maneuvering anyway. We're just kind of standing here trading arrows. Fire until you can't fire anywhere. Oh crap! Now we're getting fired on. That's not what I. I'm not talking to you, Nobunaga. We're finally at a position where we're inflicting more damage than we're taking because we've got them encircled. We're not dealing with these towers at all. They're just being a nuisance. These are some tough adversaries. Maybe I shouldn't have gone all ranged here. Maybe I should have won this one faster. But to my surprise, uh, Koto Miyoshi is going to be hanging out after the leader of the warrior monks is, is defeated. Looks like they've got the advantage. Yeah, I'd say so. Oh, she's going for the charge. Well, I mean, credit for guts, but it's a little late. You're not even going to actually reach them before you... Yeah, like I think I think we took like one damage from the cavalry actually getting to our troops. Keep the enemy right in front of their castle. And this one, you know what? I want to see if we can do this without knocking down the walls. Time for this one to... Drizzle, drazzle, drazzle, drum. Time for this one to go home. But we're going to let uh, Masako Hayami, he didn't get involved in that fight. Ryo Ryotoshi and Nobunaga, they will encircle Ishiyama Temple. These jerks are going to keep harassing us as we try to do it. So maybe I do need to just knock down the walls. But, um... Oh. Leave it to me. I didn't mean for you to discharge ahead. I guess I changed one unit's orders and not the other. We're out of horses, though. This is me being a, a big silly. We march. Need to get some horses soon. But we also need to call it a video. Uh, yeah, so uh, we're into the final phase here. The anti takata coalition that formed when we uh, had the temerity to take the capital. I keep forgetting to check what's the diplomatic op uh, options with the Imperial Court now that we hold it in our territory. Have they changed? All the money we spent on getting titles for Shingen... It was really me just having fun role-playing, because ultimately all it does is make you slightly better at diplomacy. It doesn't really do that much. Um, and what little it does means even less now. But uh, when we come back next time, well, I, mean, I guess maybe in a sense, if, we're, if we can get clans on our side faster to join the coalition a, a turn or two earlier, that might make some small difference. But really, when we come back next time, it's just going to be more uh, knockdown, drag-out fights in central Japan. Um, once we've got the Miyoshi kind of neutralized... Um, Things will calm down a lot in the West uh, because the Date didn't really engage with any clans that weren't in their neighborhood or already hostile towards us. So unless we decide to start fighting the Chosakabe, the Mori, etc., uh, we can kind of let things just sit in the West and, and use the East of Japan where forces are already hostile towards us as the place where we grab enough bases to trigger the requirements for the warband and win the game. See you guys next time.